Vegetables are the part of plants that are consumed and eaten by humans and other animals as food. For a vegetable, any part of the plant can be edible such as stem, leaves, roots, tubers or flowers and sometimes even plant fruits and seeds. Now we also classify these vegetables based on the parts of the plants that is eaten. Now do not one thing. Some of the vegetables might fit in more than one category when several different parts of the plants are edible or can be consumed as food. For example, beetroot or chukandar in Hindi. We can eat both roots and leaves. Now let's talk about different categories of vegetables. First category is stem vegetables, which have stalks as the main part of vegetable. It always grow above the ground. Some of the popular vegetable in this category are asparagus, celery, leek, kohlrabi, etc. Next we have leaf vegetables. As the name suggests, if edible part of the plant is a leaf, some might be eaten raw in form of salad like cabbage. Some other examples are spinach, watercress, lettuce, fenugreek leaves, etc. In the next category, we have flower vegetables. Some plants have edible flowers or flowers like sap which can be eaten. They are found during particular season and grown for their flower buds. Some appear like many flower buds clustered together. For example, broccoli, cauliflower, artichoke, courgette flower, banana flower, lotus, etc. Bulb vegetables Bulb kind of structure of the plants grow just below the ground. It is the portion between stem and root. You can notice the roots coming out from the bottom of the bulb. It is generally in layers of skin like onion and these are very strong in flavor. For example, onion, spring onion, leek, garlic, kohlrabi, fennel, etc. Seed vegetables in this category, we include legumes which are used as food. Seeds are normally found inside two-sided pots, hence also known as potted vegetables, sometimes eaten along with seed. There are exceptions though, like sweet corn, which you don't find in a pot. Some of the seed vegetables you can peel off like green peas, sometimes it's like French beans generally grow above the ground but some also grow below ground like peanut. Some examples are kidney beans, french beans, snow peas, fava beans, etc. Next we have root vegetables of which roots are edible and used as vegetables. Usually find long round and swollen tap root. As these are roots so grown under the soil and possess nutrients that they gain from the soil. For example, carrot, radish, beet, turnip, arrowroot, etc. Now, with the root, people also make one more category called rhizome. Its stem are either horizontal or vertical under the ground with roots. These underground plant stems are capable of producing the short or root system of a new plant. Some biologists also called these rootstock, for example, ginger and turmeric. Now, there is one more category similar to this is tubers vegetables. In this plant roots are modified and enlarged into a swollen structure usually at the end of the plant roots attached as a lump of rocks. For example, potato, cassava, artichoke, yam, etc. Next we have fruit vegetables. These are called fruit vegetables because they fulfill the botanical definition of fruits because in scientific sense a fruit contains the seed of the plant. So those plants which fruits are used as vegetables are called fruit vegetables. Generally plant fruits which has sweet and fleshy fruits and eaten raw does not include under this category. Also fruits of which grains or seeds are used doesn't fall under this category. For example, avocado, tomato, bitter gourd, eggplant, bottle gourd, bell pepper, etc. 
In the end, we have funky vegetables, commonly known as mushrooms. Please note that some mushrooms are also poisonous, which are not included in this category of vegetables. Some examples are button mushrooms, oyster, truffles, bonitus, morel, etc. Well guys, that's all about the classification of vegetables. And yes, one more thing, out of these types, root vegetables, tubers, bulb or bulbous vegetables are underground vegetables and rest are above ground vegetables.